Mr. Deepam. It was so nice to see you and I got your book as a gift, Panchakosha. Homeopathy is a divine science. And it's a beautiful book, um, very nicely presented. Many congratulations. And we need this kind of books in the current situation. Beautiful. And today we have Professor Regina from Brazil also in this yes. book review. So Dr. Deepa, First, I would like to ask this question. What made you, inspired you to write this beautiful book? Yes, uh, thank you, Dr. Kavita, ma'am, uh, for uh, conducting this uh, uh, book review. So since long time, like uh, I was uh, involved with uh, spiritual activity, more reading into spiritual things. And when the concept of Panchakosh came, so I thought like, uh, why there is nothing in homeopathy? There should be something. So I want to fill that gap. And surely I just started uh, reading uh, homeopathy, uh, Hanneman's literature, slowly, steadily, organ and, and deeply. So that gaps, the uh, spiritual teachings and organ on aphorisms, I am able to make it combined very well with the scientific uh, thing. So it's like uh, maybe the um, inspiration coming from our ancient uh, spiritual background, I feel so. Yes, ma'am. Professor yes, Regina, would you yes. like to say? Yes, please. I was very enlightened by her book. And Pashakosha, it's something we all need to know because as you say in chapter four, homeopathy alive sciences they blend and ayurveda is the ancient indian system of medicine and the organon brings in together the phenomenon and we are therapeutically hygienically dictating practices of um, macro life big life life with quality and it means not to be rich, but the richness inside of us, the richness of uh, the concepts, the richness of what we have studied, the richness of the hygienic uh, procedures we learn, and the blessings of homeopathy we offer to our clients. In your book, when you blend homeopathy and a life science, we perceive the universe and the contents through the senses, limited to five secondary qualities, psychological classification, in a way the most logical classification covers the whole sphere of thought and existence. But the living body has a soul living in it. And before we were humans, we were spirits. And God offered us many reincarnations so we can move towards perfection. The samsara wheel makes us prove that is real and that's God's blessing. We are God's hands on planet Earth. We must take the opportunity, offer him our generosity of our hearts empathy, homeopathy, and panchakosha. These mutual actions will action and react and offer not only the organism, but the spiritual organs within the self and the mind be more than the basic of the qualities we need on earth. So we have heavenly, we have the light, we have the cold and the hot, the viscous and the dry, the inactive and the active, the proactive. When the hands can't reach, our prayers for sure will reach. And in God's time, so all of this, the motionless and the mobile, it has a purpose. And it offers us a chance to be our better versions. 
in this planet. I thank you, Dr. Deepa, for a wonderful book. I encourage everyone to purchase and read in, in depth because it has about science, homeopathy, and good living, quality living. Many blessings, namaskaram. Thank you, Professor yes. Krishna. That was a wonderful message. And this book is so nicely presented with the to name few. It is very well structured. The chapter one, which speaks about the five sheets of the human being, which are very important. And the Anna Kosha, Prana, Prana Mai Kosha, Mano Mai Kosha, and about the homeopathy and the mineral magnets and the periodic table. So each chapter is so nicely presented. One, one love to read it. And again, it comes the universe, laws, and homeopathy. Connecting to the organ of medicine. So, and as Professor Regina said, homeopathy and allied senses, and you can find that mineral magnets, electricity, galvanism, and magnets for healing with nice pictures and the chakras. So, so where we can see easily, um, understanding and love to read. So beautiful book, um, Doctor. Uh, Deepa, I would love it. So anything, wherever, whichever page you will not get bored and so much to learn. With I love the beautiful case studies. Each case, how it has helped. Simple from the toothache to the many cases which maxillary sinusitis. So much to say about this book and no source implementation of the no source so recurrent frequent recurrent urinary infections. And, um, and again, Dr. Deepa, it is a wonderful book, very nicely presented. In conclusion, what would we, you want to say about this and how you want this book to be uh, reached to everyone? It is, and why, if anyone wants to buy this book, how they can reach you? It is very low cost at few words, please. Yes. Uh, now uh, we are in the era of holistic. So uh, it's like a diet, breathing and mind. So uh, we should focus on all these three things. So uh, diet is very important. So aphorisms are there included. Holistic, one should not focus on only one diet. One should not do only yoga and pranayam. One should like uh, on the, so it should be a completeness should be there. And as a homeopath, where you can find you should, uh, you should be aware of whatever the things are there. You should go for that. That's why the periodic table is also included in that. And uh, uh, the glavinism, mineral magnets, that are the last aphorisms uh, by our master Samuel Hanneman, uh, the great master Samuel Hanneman. We were like going uh, uh, one, like uh, only on the mind, only on the specific remedies, only on the mother teachers. I want to keep all that things under one roof. Because all the things are acting on a human body. All the things. So where we can depend on what the patient required. It uh, Maybe the patient is better only with diet correction. Maybe they are uh, better with some thoughts or with a grief or anything. So everything under one we should be ready with all our uh, bows and arrows and everything. And what requires, you just hit it. So if you uh, read the book, that complete, many are not aware about periodic table. They feel, what is this? Many are not aware about uh, the rubrics. Many are uh, no sorts. So I tried to take them step by step to um, write from small thing to the higher spiritual level what uh, Professor Regina Ma'am is talking. And yes, absolutely, as a homeopath, we get a simple cases, right from toothache to uh, the um, UTI or anything. So no need to afraid about the diagnosis as we are seeing man in disease, not disease in a man. So the holistic approach and that will open, that will give you some uh, vastness in your thought processes and everything and you will be not stick to one uh, method 
that's what the whole uh, concept dr kavita ma'am and professor rajina i'm so glad so happy to have this uh, review today with you because you are uh, the members who you are able to understand that that you are the right uh, people to know uh, to appreciate the things that's what i feel ma'am yes absolutely please how many pages how much and where they can purchase your book they can uh, message me on uh, my uh, mobile number or on my uh, website uh, i will uh, courier them yeah online also it is uh, available directly they can uh, uh, email me my phone number is 9902571444 many copies uh, are going yes online uh, visibility is also there yes Please. Yeah, there are one eighty two pages. The last oh. page is one eighty two, which has also has the thank you and the gratitude, which is very nicely presented. And many congratulations, Doctor Deepa, for this wonderful book, gifting this to Ka yes. Humipati Study Group yes, team. And uh, we wish you many more success and many more books to be published. If anyone has any questions, they can reach us, and we will direct you to get this book. and also we will put it in the comment section thank you Very so much important. for uh, being here today and wish you all good luck thank, thank you ma'am yes ma'am we encourage everyone to read this book that will enrich your inner life thank you highly recommend this book to everyone that can help them thank mm -hmm. you thank mm -hmm. you doctor namaskaram namaskaram